and this is one of the three things. Yes, I have prepared three files, three we charts, three charts, and and, and maybe maybe I may go for another photo also yeah. if the, if the necessity be. Hmm. Now, sir, यहाँ लोगों को आदत है वो तो बिना पढ़े उठा करके ना बोल देते हैं कि हमें हम तो विश्वास ही नहीं करते अब yeah. चक्कर है कोर्ट कचहरी तो विश्वास भी नहीं चलेगा ना नाउ 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 व्हाट एक्चुअली दिस दिस सब जिंग चार्ट मींस यू नो सी वी हैव टू अरेंज कॉमन वर्ड्स लेटर्स और फिगर्स व्हिच आर अवेलेबल इन द डिस्प्यूटेड सेट ऑफ राइटिंग्स यस सर एंड आल्सो अमंग द सो दिस इज डिस्प्यूटेड दैट इज दिस इज गुमनामी बाबा हैंड राइटिंग सैंपल्स व्हिच वी गिव यू एंड दिस इज नेताजी एडमिटेड सैंपल्स व्हिच वी गिव यू सो वी आर द सोर्स वी वी आर रिस्पांसिबल फॉर आवर द द ऑथेंटिसिटी ऑफ दिस थिंग इज आवर प्रॉब्लम इट इज माय प्रॉब्लम चंदू जी एंड आई रिस्पांसिबल फॉर द सो आई कैन अश्योर यू दिस इज नेताजी हैंड राइटिंग सैंपल्स वी हैव टेकन फ्रॉम द ऑथेंटिक सोर्स एंड दिस इज द गुमनामी बाबा सैंपल फ्रॉम 1962 This is Pavitra Mohan Roy's son, you know, uh, Mr. Ranindra Roy has given to us. So when we compare them, yes, sir. we have taken out so many common words. Hmm. When we compare them, in fact, we find a lot of similarities. In fact, I haven't told Mr. Roy about it. Mr. Roy is in America right now. Uh-huh. So I'll tell his daughter tonight that he uh-huh. got another report. Right. So he'll be happy to know. Right. So we, we, find, we find there is extraordinary similarity yes, sir. Uh, uh, in the mode of production. in the formation of letters yes sir uh, and uh, and uh, uh, there is absolutely uh, no doubt about their being similar uh, without any pale of doubt huh. without any shadow of doubt huh. they belong to, uh, to to the same source of origin huh. same person so you have explained in such a detailed manner as was, was the, the government experts that i have the report i'll show you those reports yeah. I mean, these are only one pages. There, there's no, there, there no description. That is so. not a detailed opinion, huh. and that that doesn't do justice to, to exactly that's to what anybody. Uh, justice Mukherjee said to like, because because for comprehension there is not no material there is available. Yes. Huh. How uh, will you explain? Huh. Yeah. So unless unless you so give this is and and uh, D. This is the formation or D. Yes. And then D. So this mm, this is the manner in which D is formed. Huh. This is a typical individual mannerism. Everybody will never write D like that. Hmm. On only the the same person write hmm. like this. Are the other charts ready? Only the two of them. Which okay. how many charts we have? This, this is one. This is one. Okay, here you have uh, the, this, the second chart. This is another chart. Hmm. And third one we are preparing, sir. Third is also there. Hmm. You know. Okay. These are these are some hmm. of the capital letters. Oh. Some of the capital letters. which have been selected sir let's go with c because c kyunki unka naam calcutta se wo karte the na to c ab dekhiye jaise ye ji c begins with a small loop yes small loop or a hook ha this is nitaji's handwriting yes so you calcutta was a city so obviously yeah. wo yeah so we have yeah. similar pattern here yes yeah, yeah, absolutely the, so the same letter hmm. uh, in, uh, in in the suspected writings also shows a hook What about S? Because S was the initial figure, Subhash. So S me ye gumna me uva kar. S is S is also very very similar, you know. Hmm. The similarity about it is hmm. that it is detached from the following letter. Okay. And it is slanting. So one thing I I remember, of course, if I recall, of um, uh, um, Bilal sir's report, hmm. he said that both because he had the opportunity to see lot of handwritings yeah, of Netaji and then this person also. Yeah. He said Subhash Chandra Bose and Gumnami Baba both. Yeah. Both were expert writers in a sense that they were. Uh, Certainly. There were several ways on, on in the command. They could write in different various various ways. So they were yeah. the experts. Yeah. The manner. So they could write in different ways, both of them. Yes. So they were expert. The manner of writing shows hmm. that there is a lot of natural variation. Hmm. And uh, I is quite similar. Yes. Natural variation, and uh, and uh, they have been written very aesthetically hmm. and very gracefully. The author, the author of these writings, hmm. had the capacity to write. Very aesthetic. And sir, I, I can very tell you, he was writing it. He was in a horrible place. He was in mental and trauma in a such a location. I can't tell you. I mean, even for people like us, it's a horrible place to live there. So he was in a very bad. He has written actually. You can't understand the kind of psychological and mental and bodily tr- mm. handicap that I'm living in this area. So, so, so he wrote in under tremendous stress. Uh, yes, yeah, yes. Well, that stress uh, may be obvious and apparent from. some of the por- portions of his writings yeah. as i have told you uh, that uh, some of the writings i, I will be re- referring hmm. especially to some of the writings hmm. now now these are uh, again some of the small letters 
Okay. Yeah. Earlier we referred to capital letters. Okay. These are some of the small letters which are uh, occurring in both the sets of writings. Hmm. This is the set of disputed writings. Hmm. And this is the set of the admitted writings. Hmm. So when we compare and keep these individual letters together, you find that there is a, a very, very great amount of similarity. Hmm. Very great amount of similarity. And, and uh, it should demolish any suspicion that yes. they could have been written by by two different persons. Huh. Yeah, because we have uh, <laughs> noted a trend that people who have, you know, without uh, having any expertise, they have so overnight become experts and they try to compare. And then I've been saying that this is the job of an expert to compare handwritings. Not yes, sir. ordinary people cannot do that. Ordinary people, you know, start becoming experts. As so you, then, <laughs> as I told you, uh, uh, as per the qualification of, of an expert, he should have a great, great deal of experience, hmm. experience of examination of documents. Okay, then he can have a, a, a proper appreciation of the habits and mannerisms of the people making the signatures or writing. Okay. Now, so, uh, 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 because as I have told you that the writing is not a mechanical process. Yes, sir. It is very much influenced by the temperament, hmm. by the cir circumstances, hmm. and by the the mood of the writer. Hmm. So they, they affect his posture also. Hmm. Yeah. Stand, standing and writing. Yes. Uh, yes. Sleeping. Suppose, suppose he's sleeping and then he is to put uh, some writing signature. Yes. Or when he stands up. Hmm. Or he stands up in stress. Hmm. He is he's in stress. Hmm. That also will uh, have some uh, influence upon his writing. Yes, so some of his uh, the suspected writings are an indication of an obviously a great amount of stress on his brain. He was also uh, in I'm pain, sure arthritis you. problem with the suffering. Sure you. Oh, that's because uh, because we received, no, no, for instance, this is one of the two letters that you are given. Yes, we have given yeah. yes, And this is another, another letter. Yes. Well, to an ordinary observer, observer, they will appear to be different writings. Hmm. But here, what has to be appreciated is So, uh, comparing these these two documents, oh. suspected documents, there are there is a lot of material, a plethora of material, yeah. which shows that uh, the mechanism, the mode of production, the formation of letters of words, is 
extraordinarily similar. Hmm. Although the, the conditions in which they might have been written may not be similar, hmm. but the author, the authorship is quite similar. Hmm. So there is absolutely no scepticism as far as this point of, uh, hmm. uh, as far as this.